What's up, all my devil dogs? It's your boy, Sean Ali, Strength Corps Zion Five Star General. Another workout for y'all. This time, it's a push day again, man. And you see my boy right here, Daniel, came to visit from Kentucky, came to work out with us, man, me and my boy E. So uh, we warmed up with the chest flies and then we jumped it off. Y'all know how I like to do it. Dumbbell incline press. We did five sets, man. We were going, we were going hard, man. We started off, I used 100, uh, Dan used 100, and then my boy E right here, he's hopping up in weight, man. He, he used to use 70s, he went ahead and did the 80s today, so he's growing, man. Uh, he's the dude who's always recording my shit for me, so in case y'all was wondering who that was, all right? Now, on the last set, what we did was, we took a lighter weight and went to about 10 to 12, and then I dropped the weight pretty much in half. I think I got 50s and went ahead and did that. Now, Dan here, he used the 50s, did all of those with the 50s on the drop set, and then did a double drop set and went down to the 40s. You know what I mean? That was pretty damn intense, man. Um, I didn't do it because I didn't know everybody else was going to do that, or I would have. So I felt kind of like a little bitch, to be honest, but whatever. <laughs> I made up for it later on in the workout, and he did the same thing, man. And you got a really good pump from this, man. I mean, I got a good pump just doing a double drop, so I can only imagine the pump from a triple drop. I'm going to have to try it next time. All right. Next thing we did, we went on ahead and we did some uh, flat bench on the hammer strength, man. I really like the hammer strength machine. I used to not be a fan of this particular machine, but if you set it up right, then you can really get a good contraction. And so we did again. The first four sets were straight. The last set was a drop set and everybody did that. We really were going for a good pump in the chest, man. Um, and we, we achieved it. You know, we wanted to really get in our reps today, really get in some intensity. And we were pushing each other to go to failure and pass failure with the drop sets and even some force reps on the, uh, the beginning part of our set. So uh, right here, E, finishing his off, stripping that weight off, and then bam. Try this out, man. Drop sets are a great intensity technique to use to initiate growth, man. All right. Then we went ahead and did three sets of the incline flies. You know, you're bringing the ropes up. You know, upwards is going to work the upper chest. When you bring them downwards, it's going to work the lower chest. All right. A little tip for you in case y'all didn't know. A lot of people think that these upwards flies actually works your lower pec when it actually focuses more on the upper, the clavicular. All right. Then we did two sets of just straight flies. All right. We wanted to make sure we're hitting both, but we wanted to emphasize the upper chest. It's a lot harder to get the upper chest to pop than it is to get the lower chest to pop. So I always try and do a little more inclines than decline stuff or even flat stuff. Then we moved on and we did some dumbbell shoulder press and we supersetted those with uh, dumbbell lateral raises, all right? Now these are tough, man, because you're doing a heavy compound and then you're dropping down and when you do this, you really feel the squeeze in your lateral head, man, because you're already exhausted from the big compound movement, all right? Now, if you really want to try something hard, you can also do the reverse. Do the lateral raises first and then do the dumbbell shoulder press. And that's going to be almost like pre-exhaustion. All right. So you can go either way with that. But either way, it's going to be intense, man. And this is really good to bring up the delts, man. Um, delts is something that you want to kind of hit hard because for a lot of people, it's it, they're very stubborn muscles, man. The really only time you see people with good shoulders are one, if you have good shoulder genetics or two, you're on, you know, the J, you know what I mean? But we keep it natural over here, natural bodybuilding channel. So we just work hard and we do drop sets, all right? Last exercise right here, we just did some machine press and then superset it with some dumbbell reverse flies. Wanted to make sure we hit the rear delts. We didn't hit any front delts because we did so much pressing. I really don't emphasize the front delts too much unless I'm at, like having a shoulder day exclusively, then I'll do some front delts. All right, but dude Dan right here, he's got monster shoulders. Dude was huge. He's like 6'5", 230. He was, he was dwarfing me and my boy E, man, but we still put in the work, man. He really pushed us, and yo, we had one of the best workouts we've had in a while, all right? Last thing we knocked out, we just did five sets of this incline tricep machine. All right, and that was it, man. Long, hard workout, man. We really put in the work, all right? Stay tuned for the end while I introduce you to my boy Dan. All right, y'all. So we just finished our workout, man. Killed chest, shoulders, and tries. Y'all saw, man. We went in. 
Oh, I'm fucking exhausted right now, boy. Real quick, it's my boy Daniel. Say what's up to the people. What's up, man. people? How y'all doing? Hey, man, Daniel, yo, he's got a gift. Yo, he knows how to pump people up, man. Me and Amelia, yo, we usually pump each other up pretty good, but this guy right here, I mean, we were doing extra reps. We were doing double drop sets, all yep. kinds of shit. Yep. So it was it was definitely a good workout, man. But uh, tell them about where you're from, man. What you doing? Tell them what you're doing out in Kentucky, man. You're doing some good shit out Yeah, there. man, uh, from Louisville, Kentucky, uh, getting ready to start a business up. Been putting videos together. I'm trying to launch it all at one time. Uh, just getting it in, man. Hitting it hard every day, six days a week, seven days. I'm trying to do cardio, abs three or four days a week. I'm doing good down there. That's what's up, man. So if any of y'all out there in Kentucky, man, hook up with my boy right here, man. He's he's he gonna go some places, man. He's obviously he's a big dude. Probably makes me look small as shit on camera. You know what I'm saying? No, that's, like, a, that's an understatement. For real, show. Like for real, he was 6'5", <laughs> about what, 230? 235. 235, so he's a big dude, man. I'm like 208, 6'2", so. But, yeah, well, hey, we go hard, man. That's what we do this yeah, shit, buddy. so. All right, y'all. Thanks for joining us again. Don't forget, comment below, as always. Don't forget the orders. Subscribe and share. Like and comment. Until next time, my double dogs. Dismiss. Triple beam dreams and drug schemes of mad cream. Could be a sad scene when you go to that extreme. Triple beam dreams and drug schemes of mad cream. Could be a sad scene when you go to that extreme.